Greetings from Las Vegas. What goes on here will not stay here as we cover NBA Summer League here on Warriors TV. And you look at the stories leading into this Summer League schedule here in 2014. And there's, of course, a win streak that we'll talk about in just a bit. But there's also head coach Steve Kerr leading the team in practices and the games to come. Here's some of what he said today after practice about looking forward to game number one. Well, we actually had a a scrimmage last night which helped uh, just kind of you know get get roles on the sidelines and, and see the game uh, from that perspective but uh, tomorrow you know it'll be be on TV and the guys will be playing in front of a couple thousand people and so it's uh, it feels more like the real thing so it'll be good uh, for our staff but but particularly for the players you know the big thing with summer league is these guys are all trying to get jobs whether in the NBA or the D League or overseas and so a huge part of Summer League is player development, giving them exposure, trying to help their careers along and uh, giving them a chance to, to show people they can play. And of course, the Warriors winning ways here in Las Vegas span several years as we give you a bit of a flashback. The Warriors are riding a 14-game NBA Summer League winning streak in Friday's game against the Hornets at the Thomas & Mack Center. A streak which spans the course of several years now. And in the very early stages of this streak, some of the players on the Warriors Summer League squad met baseball legend Pete Rose in person here in Las Vegas. Charlie Hustle's jersey number, 14. Win streak, 14. Coincidence? Yes. And on that same journey, we stopped into Gold and Silver Pond, the home of the History Channel show Pond Stars, as Chumley was taking part in Summer League festivities. We brought Harrison Barnes to meet the stars of the Blue Man Group. Draymond Green took a magic carpet ride with former warrior Charles Jenkins, while another former warrior, Jeremy Tyler, sang along with Big Elvis at Harrah's. Much has changed in two years, but the Summer League win streak remains, heading into the action here in Vegas at the start of this 2014 edition. So yes, when you think of all the great winning streaks in sports over the years, you have the uh, Dolphins and the Lakers in the early 70s, of course, De La Salle football and the Warriors Summer League winning streak. And let's see if they can take it to 15. Much more coverage coming here on Warriors TV.